Hi all, welcome to this edition of a beginner's guide to triathlon equipment. So we're going to talk about swim caps. What they are, why we need them, um, and do you actually need to wear them during a race scenario. So a swim cap is used for a couple of different reasons. One, it keeps your head warm. Brilliant. Um, especially if you're doing any sort of open water swimming where you know, you're know you swimming in a body of water which is absolutely freezing. River swimming can be absolutely freezing because you've got a constant um, flow of water which doesn't have an opportunity to warm up like a lake swim would. And again, that will depend on the time of year as well. The It, it will keep your hair dry, so it, um, benefit for those with longer hair. But the third point, and it's probably the point that... Um, a race organizer um, requires you to wear one of these it allows you to be seen within the body of water so if you are um, in a lake swim or in a sea swim and it's a the organization's responsibility to ensure you are safe these will allow you to be sighted and generally you tend to have um, swimming caps which are brightly colored i think i got another one here Actually, yeah, I have a nice yellow one. So if you're, you know, swimming in the sea somewhere, you, you should be seen. Um, chance, and what race organisers generally tend to do is ensure that everyone is wearing the same colour. So they will be handed out in the race pack and they will be mandatory. Um, I have known people to lose their swim cap and have to have a replacement. That You can't swim without it. So... What people do though as well, they'll swim in two swim caps and there's a couple of different, and there's a reason for that as well. Um, it, it will depend on how cold the water is and some people will wear two swim caps to keep their head a little bit warmer. But also people will um, have a preference on how they wear their swimming goggles. Some people will wear their goggles, they'll put the goggles on and a swim cap over so the um, strap of the, the goggles are, are not visible and it, it's a little bit harder for them to be hit off if someone is swimming close to you. Um, some people will wear it on top and that's more of a comfort thing. But some people will wear two swim caps um, to secure their goggles as well. So the first one goes on, um, that keeps their hair in place, it keeps their head warm. Then their goggles go on at, over that because they have a preference to wear their goggle strap on top of um, uh, a swim cap and then they'll put the race swim cap on top so remember if you're always wearing two swim caps the race um, swim cap that's been given to you by the by that particular event needs to go on top so there you go guys you don't need a swim cap for training you will probably need it for a race scenario and left it in a pool um, it'll all come down to what the race organizers require you to do so check out your race pack i hope that's helped Check out our other videos where we're looking at all the pieces of equipment that you need for a triathlon. Cheers all.